This video is about uh, learning to use Microsoft uh, Visio 2003-2007 for uh, developing an office layout, uh, especially with regards to uh, a cubicle. So I'll be going over some of the features of Visio that, uh, that facilitate this. Uh, starting up with uh, Visio, this is the startup screen. And we're going to choose here maps and floor plans, and then specifically office layout. We're going to choose U.S. units and then create. This will open uh, a set of stencils over here on the left that are uh, usable for an office layout. First thing we want to look at here is the size of the drawing sheet. It's important in Visio. If you look at the ruler up at the top, uh, along the top of the page, we're going 22 feet wide and we're going to 17 feet uh, high. So if, uh, that's suitable for the size of the office layout that you're doing. Uh, this is the sheet you want. Otherwise, uh, if you need more space, or if it's a very small cubicle that you're laying out, you might want to go to changing the scale. You can do that by going to File, uh, and Page Setup. And in here, we'll see Drawing Scale. Right now, the drawing scale is set for 1 half inch equals 1 foot 0 inches. And if we need more room, we could change that to quarter inch, or change that to uh, three-eighths, three-quarters. We're assuming that this is a suitable size now for a cubicle. We're going to cancel out of this. Uh, first thing you want to do is look at what kind of cubicle furniture it is that you have uh, to put it, use it, make the cubicle out of it. I'm assuming here that uh, I'm looking at the cubicle around me. And I'm seeing uh, I'm going to put some panels in here for the cubicle. Uh, this right now is a four-foot panel. We're going to view a size and position window, which is going to show us the size of this, and it shows us a uh, four-foot length. Uh, I don't have any four-footers in mind. I'm going to change that to a three-footer. And we're going to use some uh, panel posts. Put that right in here. And uh, working with a 9 by 12 cubicle, I'm going to take that 3 foot uh, panel and attach it to the post. And, and I'm just going to copy it by holding down the control button. And uh, copy that again. I'm going to slide these over, put the panels together, get another panel post, and put it down here at the end. Then take some panels and uh, again change this to a three foot panel. And take my panel and turn it this way. Catch up here to the post. And uh, the panel ended up not exactly at three feet. Copy that one, copy it again, copy it again. And stick all these together. I now have a 12 foot dimension of the cubicle in that direction. And I'm going to add a wall as part of this cubicle. Again, there's, there's all kinds of variations that are possible. I'm go to walls, doors, and windows. And I'm going to take a wall section, drag it over here, uh, turn it around, and it's going to go at the end of my cubicle. And it just goes right past the cubicle. Then I'm going to take some of these uh, cubicle sections, copy down here, copy again, attach it to the post. And leave one section open for people to come in. Now I'm ready to put some furniture in the cubicle. So I'm going to go to uh, cubicles and uh, 
Make everybody gets a corner surface. So I'm gonna bring this over, and this corner doesn't look exactly like the corners that I've got. Uh, it's a four foot corner, and uh, I'd like my corner to be a little bit smaller. I'm gonna stick it over in the corner, and I'm going to drag this down to three feet by three feet. Now it's looking a lot more like my corner except for this curve in the back. And what I'm going to do there is go and look at this size and position uh, of my corner surface. And in addition, I'm going to put uh, shape data. And I have a chamfer, a radius, and I'm going to change that radius to zero. I do that, it squares off the corner. Now, uh, I want to bring a work surface in, and that's a four foot work surface that I just brought in. I'm going to take that down to three feet, and take the work surface, hold down the control key, rotate the work surface, put it in right here. Take this work surface, copy it up to here, hold down the control key. And for people walking in here, I'm going to have a work peninsula. I'm going to rotate that and I'm going to put that right here. One more work surface. That. And I would like to have some office uh, uh, furniture. And in this case, uh, I'm going to bring in a lateral file. for my cubicle. I'm going to bring in some office equipment, office access, rather, uh, let's see, I like to have a chair, a desk chair. seats for the people who are going to be in here with me. So that's a uh, layout for my uh, cubicle. We'll enhance this video with uh, drawings, titles, dimensions, and annotations in the next video.